What's up everyone, Jets Takeoff. Breaking Jets news, the Jets have signed Solomon Thomas defensive tackle to a one-year deal. Now, we need depth on the defensive line since we lost fully Fadakasi and we're looking a little bit thin. We don't know if we can count on Rankins. So Solomon Thomas, he's the former third overall pick. He has familiar familiarity with Robert Saul in San Francisco. And although it didn't work out, there are still a lot of people that believe he has untapped potential, and so do I. He was a third overall pick for a reason. They got him from the Mitch Trubisky trade. But I like this signing because I think Solomon Thomas definitely has a better role in the NFL as more of an interior defensive lineman than kind of an edge where he was put in uh, before in San Francisco. And I think maybe Salah has, has seen the tape of him on the Raiders and thinks he has a role in this offense. And I think there's a very good chance he could be a starter for us uh, next to Quentin Williams or if we move uh, if we move John Franklin Myers inside. But this is a one-year deal, so if it doesn't work out, it's not like we're tied to a financially devastating contract. If anything, I think this is probably a, a one-year $5 million type of deal, so not bad at all. And I think there is still some untapped potential, like I said, too. It's a quality signing. It's not earth-shattering. It's not like our defense is going to go to a top-10 unit now because of this signing, but I like it. He's a good character guy. Um, and yeah, so familiarity, familiarity with Robert Sala, and we need more bodies. So I like this signing a lot. I know this is a different type of video since I'm on my phone. I want to get this out uh, very quickly. He also had three and a half sacks this past season and two forced fumbles too. So like I said, it's quality. Now he only had, I think, three tackles for loss. So it's not like that jumped off the page, but two forced fumbles definitely speaks volume to me because those are turnover worthy plays. Uh, and Solomon Thomas was the fact, was the reason why. So I like the signing and we'll see how it goes, but I like how we're getting more depth and we're getting a guy with high upside. So let me know what you guys think. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.